Well, with its first weekend in the books, the Minnesota State Fair is in full swing. Uh, Josh Peterson is at the fair and met with State Fair officials about what is new for this year's fair. It's that time of year when Minnesota summer winds down, but its biggest party is just getting started. In its record year, 1.8 million people visited the Minnesota State Fair, making it the second largest fair in the country. And this year's fair offers its guests a variety of new attractions. So there's a ton of new stuff going on. We obviously, you know, it's the same great fair as every year, but we always make sure to have new stuff going on every year to keep coming, keep people, keep people coming back for more. But new attractions aren't the only new things spectators will experience. This year, an expanded security presence has also been brought to this year's fair. Fake checks aren't really new at the state fair. We've been doing it at our grandstand for years now. Um, so it's just an expanded level of security to ensure that everyone coming to the state fair still has the same safe, great, enjoyable time at the fair. Each year, the Minnesota State Fair prides itself on showcasing the best that Minnesota has to offer. But when it comes to selecting what will be new each year for the fair, that could be a tough job for fair officials. It is about experience, it's about quality of product, it's about, you know, a need, do we have a need? Maybe we don't need another French fry vendor, but are you bringing something really cool and different to the table? For some who attend the great Minnesota get-together, they make it a point to check out what's new at the fair. We try to. We like to go online beforehand and see everything that's new, but sometimes it's hard because there's too much new food. Even for those who have never been to the Minnesota State Fair before, they are finding out there is just so much to see and experience while at the fair. This is actually my first time at the State Fair, so I'm a rookie, and what? it's just awesome. There's so much to see and do here, so I definitely think you should all check it out. The Great Minnesota Get-Together, showcasing all things old and new at the Minnesota State Fair. In Falcon Heights, I'm Josh Peterson at the Minnesota State Fair, Lakeland News. If you would like to see a list of the new attractions at the State Fair, you can visit our website at lptv.org. Our Josh Peterson will have reports throughout the week from the fair. The Minnesota State Fair runs through Labor Day. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.